Instead of buying beer in college, I'm like investing $500 a month in buying these stupid knives. And I'd find like a CEO of an insurance company I'd want to get a meeting with. I'd engrave the CEO's name. I'm investing like 300 bucks in a couple knives. CEO's name, family name, spouse's name. In this case, it was a wife. And I put a little handwritten note inside. It said, carve out five minutes for me. I promise it'll be worth your time. I'm packaging this up in my dorm room. 20 years old. I'm mailing this off. Two weeks later, I get a phone call in my dorm room. This is like pre-cell phone days. And it's the CEO, Mr. Smith's assistant, Jan. Jan says, hey, we got your package. Mr. Smith was super impressed. He wants to take a meeting with you next Tuesday at two o'clock. I got class next Tuesday at two o'clock. This is a $200 million company. So I cancel class. I wear the one suit I have on. I walk into the boardroom. It's like mahogany, like your typical, like Glen Gary, Glen Ross. And I'm sweating bullets. In walks Mr. Smith. He's like in his mid sixties. I walk in and he looks at me in his jaw at the ground. He's like, are you the John Rulin that sent me the knives? Yes, sir. I mean, I thought you'd be like some seasoned sales executive like in their 50s. Like, I'm really confused. Are you here to sell me knives? And I nervously laughed. I said, no, sir. I'm here to help you and your thousand sales reps do exactly what I did to you to your top 10,000 relationships. And his jaw hit the ground again. Yeah.